Well, this is a half of that carved that carved last night, uh, or yesterday afternoon, Suzanne. Um, you want to have to pull a calf from. There's the uh, there's the calf down there. We'll see if we can we'll see if we can get up and move it down the paddock there. Come on, old fella. Come on. Come on, up here. Get. Up here. Get. Up here. Get. Come on, up here. Go. Up here. Go. Come on, down you go. You're not, not good at moving. There he is. His, his yeah. legs are probably a bit sore. I think his front legs there. But um, it's a, a little black pearl. 42 kilos he went. Um, you know, like it, it's a fairly solid car for a, for a for a heifer. But um, the trouble is, you know, it wasn't that difficult a pull. It was a very awkward pull. But the um, the trouble the trouble is with um, you know her family. You know, like they get a bull calf for the first uh, calf, and instead of sort of spitting it out on time or, or a couple of days early, they hang on to it for a um, for a, you know be a couple of days late, and so you you get a, a sort of a, a big lazy you know bull you know bull calf there. And, you know, see if we can get it moving. Go on, you go with mum. Come on, off you go. You go with mum. <laughs> he likes he likes drinking. Off you go. Come on. Off you go with mum. Come on, keep going. Down you go. Down you go. Come on. Yes, mum. She's a nice she's a nice cow, isn't she? Or heifer. When do they stop becoming heifers and and become cows? I suppose with their second calf. Come on, little fella. I'll move her down into the with all the other heifers now. He's right. He's coming. No, this way. That's right. Keep going. Keep going this way. Hey. Come on, out here. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on, Mama. Follow him out. Well, that it comes through the gate. Hey, there he is. Is <laughs> a Davy one? Is a Davy one? Says Anthony. Yeah. Oh, I hope I haven't heard his feet. Had the chat to have the chains on low down around his pastures to start with just to get his legs far enough out so he can get him over the fetlocks there. But uh, he's a bit he's a bit sore in the front there isn't he? He's a good drinker. He likes he likes the old milk bar there. There he goes now he's <laughs> he likes that food. Yep. I tell you what, I I gotta give it to them. I you know you pull a calf from them and yeah, you know, like they they don't know anything about. It. I think they actually appreciate the help that you give them, and um, and then uh, and then they go and uh, yeah. You know, I, I sort of expect to have trouble with them mothering up to it, but they yeah. You, know, you leave the calf in the yard with them, and they you know within about a minute or two they're over to it, licking at it, and you know. Getting it up and you know take to it. They, I don't. Yeah, you know, touch wood. I haven't had any troubles with, you know, with the heifers mothering them. At um, even with a, a bit of a you know, a trying circumstances. Yeah. There's a, there's a sheep. There's a, 
the one on the um, you know, left there is the one is Jed's sheep. You can see the I don't know if you can see the scar on its, in its foreleg there where the skin's peeling off there, but, but it's still lame in it, but it's, it's getting around, it's putting weight on it. Yeah. No, I might hang on to them for a bit yet, but uh, that's that's all Durana in that paddock here, that little paddock here, but they're nice and safe in here with the fish around. And, uh, they go funny, I put in the hay for them and they never ever touch the hay, they no, don't know about it, you know, they won't touch the hay. They just go after their nuts. Yep. Oh, we've got trouble down here too. <laughs> two cows. They're, they're, oh, they're, they're absolute bitches. These uh, these cows. You know, like particularly the heifers. Like they'll probably come up and pick on this one I just put in with them. You know, they they were mates before, but they yeah, they're they're, uh, they're funny. Okay, see you, Suzanne.